Three people are dead in an overnight shooting here in East Baton Rouge Parish. Now, this was the scene just before 2 o'clock this morning on Palmer Avenue near South Harrells Ferry Road. That's where we find NBC Local 33's Courtney Williams. She's been there overnight gathering the latest information. Courtney, what can you tell us? Well, pieces are still being put together as of right now, but actually a 14-year-old actually saved the life of him and his brother. He called authorities around midnight, as he said, his mom's ex-boyfriend actually came in the house and started shooting here on Palmer Lane, which is right off of South Harrells Ferry Road. He took he took himself and his 12-year-old brother behind the house and got away from the scene. Now, when authorities arrived, two females and one male were found. And the 48-year-old suspect attempted to flee the scene but was caught in the Shenandoah area after the 14-year-old actually told authorities the description of his vehicle. Now, in speaking with Sheriff Sid Gotro, he says that he's still trying to wrap his head around the situation. I just feel for the subjects, you know, you know the victims. Uh, I just don't know, you know, what, what kind of thoughts go through somebody's mind to, to perpetrate some kind of violence against another human being. But. Now, the identities of the suspect and victims have not been released as of yet. The coroner's office was pulled up around about an hour ago, so they're still at the scene. But, of course, we will keep you updated through this newscast through our free VR Proud app, or you can go to our website at vrproud.com. Live in Baton Rouge, Courtney Williams. Back to you guys in the studio.